Hello and welcome back to Mobile Gaming News Weekly. We are the gaming on phone team that specializes in bringing the mobile gaming news to your feed at the earliest availability. In today's video, we will discuss Need for Speed Mobile Early Access, along with Arena Breakout Global Release and rebranding of FIFA into EA Sports FC and more. So make sure to watch the video till the end and without any further delay, let's get right into it. The start of the week, Need for Speed Mobile, after a long wait, is finally gearing up to open its intense racing experience on mobile to the world, starting from the availability of the game as early access in Australia for Android and iOS devices. With its open world setting, players will have the opportunity to explore a vast 10km by 10km map, which also comes with the challenges of navigating diverse racetracks and confronting dynamic weather conditions in Need for Speed Mobile. Moving forward, Space Invaders World Defense is an upcoming AR mobile game brought to you by Taito Corporation. The game was announced back in 2021. Now according to developers, the game Space Invaders World Defense will get a global release on the 18th of July 2023. Space Invaders is a classic title and is a really popular IP that has a dedicated fan base of its own. The game will deliver the same action-packed adventurous experience for the players to experience in an augmented reality backed system. Up next, after months of speculation and waiting, EA has finally announced the global launch date of EA Sports FC 24, the new rebranded version of the fan-favorite series FIFA. EA Sports FC is set to hit the ground on 29 September 2023. Along with its console version, EA also announced that the mobile counterpart of EA Sports FC, FC Mobile, will also launch this fall 2023. EA Sports FC Mobile will release as an in-game update on both Android and iOS via Google Play and App Stores for all their existing players, bringing new features, game modes and over 19,000 authentic players updated with the latest transfers from around the world. Moving next, OnePlus has announced that DC Dark Legion, a strategy game that takes place in the DC Universe, will soon be launched. Licensed by Warner Brothers Interactive Entertainment, on behalf of DC, DC Dark Legion presents an action-packed strategy game that allows players to recruit beloved DC superheroes and supervillains engaging in a global multiplayer battle for survival, justice and freedom. Enthusiastic fans can anticipate the opportunity to combat wickedness alongside their beloved DC characters when DC Dark Legion will release on Android and iOS devices in 2024. Next up, EA revealed its goals and expansions for its EA Sports FC brand and gaming ecosystem at the recently concluded EA Sports FC 24 trailer launch event. EA is set to expand its mobile games portfolio with EA Sports FC Mobile, the rebranded version of FIFA Mobile, and EA Sports FC Tactical, which is already available as early access under the name of Tactical Football in select regions. Besides these, EA also confirmed a set of different projects under the brand EA Sports FC, including World of League Football that is set to release in the near future. And if you're enjoying it so far, please consider giving this video a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. Your support goes a long way in helping our channel grow. And for now, let's get back to the video. The much-awaited first-person shooter Arena Breakout has released globally on 14th July. The officials have also announced that a light version of the game will be arriving shortly to match the requirements of lower-end devices. This new version that arrived offers improved performance by reducing the size of textures and overall game size. However, as a consequence, there has been a compromise on the graphics quality of the game but is not expected to significantly impact the gameplay experience. Next one, mobile gamers have spent more than $40 billion in 2023. The latest report by Data.ai brings in stats on user spendings and downloads on both apps and games in the mobile sphere in 2023 via the Google Play Store and Apple App Store, with downloads showcasing growth. Although spending on game was pretty much the same as last year's first half, with a minor drop. All in all, mobile apps saw an increase in consumer spending across the two platforms. Last but not the least, Arkansas Games has officially made its captivating dark fantasy idol RPG Mad Tale available on both iOS and Android platforms. Mad Tale is described as a strategic idol roguelike game that puts a dark twist on traditional fairy tales. In this game, players have the opportunity to assemble their own team of iconic characters from fables such as Cinderella and Snow White, each possessing unique and personalized abilities. Players who choose to download and log into the game immediately will be rewarded generously with various enticing bonuses. 
So that's it for today, we'll be back with more exciting mobile gaming videos soon. Meanwhile, you can always check the previous week's news highlights and our website www.gamingonphone.com. So see you in the next video.